Underway in southeast Georgia, too. Officials in Ware County, they've been pretty concerned about a high winds that could knock out power and bring the possibility of downed trees like we're seeing there in that live shot from Mandarin. News for Jack's reporter Ann Maxwell live in Ware County with new details on the county's preparations this evening. Yeah, Ken, we're about an hour and a half, two hours north of Tiffany, so we're still waiting for that storm to get here. We are getting uh, the heavy clouds, some winds here and there, and like you mentioned, they are really concerned about wind more than anything else in this storm. Uh, I spoke with the emerg emergency management director a little while ago. He said the winds are expected to pick up here in the next couple hours, and then he said starting around 9 o'clock, that's when things are going to start to go downhill. That's the word he used. Now, overnight, beginning around midnight, According to emergency management, there's a possibility for severe weather. That means tornadoes, heavy rain, flash flooding, heavy winds. So emergency officials are urging you to stay off the roads tonight. Uh, you don't want to be, be causing something that, you know, causes first responders to have to put themselves in harm's way to get to you. And also... Uh, if it's really bad tonight, they might not be able to get to you until things calm down. So officials are also urging people to stock up on supplies for a couple days just in case of a power outage, uh, especially those people who live in rural areas around here, urging them to have enough water in particular. Uh, crews are standing by to deal with down trees, down power lines as they come. But right now we're still watching and waiting. Emergency Operations Center is open here in Ware County and officials are closely monitoring and again, urging people to stay off the roads later tonight as Helene rolls in. For now, reporting live in Ware County, I'm Ann Maxwell, Channel 4, The Local Station.